do this before going to the second C. By the way, guys, I changed my haircut because summer is coming and I'm sweating like a bitch. So if you are a guy and you just finished your the last quest in Blocks Roots and you're ready to go to the second C, you need to do those things first before you go into the second C. All right, the first thing is hacky or Aki? No. Now it's called Aura. 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 Something like that. And if you have level 700 and you don't have this Aura, I don't know what are you doing blocks for it. And without this Aura, I don't recommend you going to the second C. Alright, how to obtain this thing? To get this thing, you need the boat. Okay, so you sail your boat to this island because you can get two very, very important things. Flash step and this Aura. When you're here, you'll see this strange cave right there. So you just need to go through and you will see these color specialist and ability teacher I, I didn't remember that color specialist stands here so we need this guy ability teacher he can teach you air jump aura and flash step you need to know all the things that's so important because without air jump you can do double or triple or quadro or so without it you can jump like this so you definitely need it next you need aura that's exactly what i have right now so this pink aura that's the final stage of the aura guys i forgot the most important thing glasses but i have different one so now the things going better write in comments do like my glasses air jump costs ten thousand that's nothing aura cost twenty five thousand. that's nothing too and the flash step cost ten hundred southern belly yeah that's a lot but you need to buy it once and forget about this what this flash step do point your cursor on every direction and just click r Boom! and you can teleport to this thing of course you have cooldown around 30 seconds or something like that so when you got these all things you need to go next so the next important thing is instant or observation hacking that's the old name so you need to go to the skylands of course if you have uh, level 750 and you're ready to go to the second C, you will know this you will know this place of course so we're going to the skylands and we need to go up here right there that's the place where we can obtain this thing oh here we are an upper section of this place so just go inside now we need to go to on this route straight forward to that temple you'll see this temple did you see this temple right here oh so that's exactly the place where we need to go don't forget that we have hidden storage right there get a lot of chests right there so we're going up right here and you will see you'll meet this instant teacher yeah that's definitely a different name because the old name i don't remember the old name of that guy tough guy or something like that <laughs> right in the comments if you remember so we need to speak to him and you can buy this buy this instinct that's so useful thing so useful and you and you can play and you can pvp without these things so that's so important you need to get this thing before going to the second C. So what the instincts do? As you can see, you'll be able to see some enemies through the walls or another direction. Or if you use the pale scarf accessory, range of your sight will increase, I remember, a lot, <laughs> a lot. You can see even players running on the different islands. The most important thing of this instinct is that you can dodge attacks. So if you use uh, your instinct, I can show you because I have this ice fruit damn oh, all right anyway when you use this instinct you can dodge enemies attack so you have uh, around five dodges or if you use this pale scarf you have 10 dodges so plus two so the requirements you need the level 300 you need to kill saber expert or something like that that boss opens when you solve the saber puzzle and you need to prepare 750 southern belly yeah and after that you can buy this thing i already have a complete guide how to get the instinct so don't forget to watch it link below be in description so you can evolve it yeah you can awaken this instinct to v4 to v2 v4 <laughs> never mind guys by doing some puzzle if you need a guide for that write in the comments i'll do my best after you got this instinct you can bring experience what does it mean you can collect dodges so if you come back to the instinct teacher you'll see that you can check your status you press this button and you'll see your current master experience seems to be 1478 that's my exact amount of dodges if you collect 
5,000, you can evolve your instinct. As you can see, I didn't have 5,000 dodges and I can't start this puzzle because you need to solve the puzzle, of course, to get this V2. And of course, I'll make the guide for that. The guide will be on my channel, of course. So that's the most important thing, but not the last. The next thing is to get accessories. Accessories is the most important part in this game because they can buff you, they can increase your damage, increase your dodges, increase your speed or something like that. And of course, before going to the second C, you need to obtain them, not all, only which you need. In my opinion, we have two important maybe or useful accessories in the game. First is Tomo Ring. This Tomo or Tomo Ring can increase your blocks for damage. That's so sweet. You get this accessory, you need 500 Southern Belly. And also in your stats, you need to have 200 milli. So where to get this? Where to buy this? We need to go to this castle. That's exactly the place where we need to go. So right here, Yoshi. Yoshi stands right there. Look at this guy. Mm, look at these muscles. All right, this guy can sell us this tomorrow. So as you can see, he offer us the ring for 5 100k belly that's so good in pvp or grinding your mastery on your blocks roots but that's not so useful because you'll use melee or swords attacks very often and to increase those damage you need a special accessory so you have two ways get the cool shades from cyborg boss which has drop chance one two percent that's a big problem because the cyborg boss is very famous popular boss in the first sea and everybody in the server trying to kill him and every time when you go to that location and trying to find the cyborg boss you'll find nothing because someone already killed him we need the accessory right now and we don't want to wait you need the black cape this black cape increase your damage all types of your damage by five percent and also increase your health by 100 not percent just 100 and you don't need to do anything. You just come and get it. Let's see. You can get this accessory when you have at least 50 level. So here you can obtain this very, very easily. Okay, at least it's not random. You need to find a special tower. I, I don't remember exact tower. So we search right now. We need to look. Oh, first try, guys. So you'll see this entrance right there and you'll see these parlous parlous or something like that. Yeah, look at this guy. Every guy in blocks look interesting, I can say. Mm -hmm. Of course, me too. Brandon comes. Did you love my buddy? Okay, <clears throat> we need to speak to that boy. Speak. Okay, I speak. He can sold us this black cape for 50 Southern Valley. That's so cheap. This black cape is what you need. That this thing is so useful and you can get it when you level 50. And you need to waste your time killing some bosses again, again, again. Because in the second C, you'll get better accessories. And if you get this accessory just starting playing in the first C, that will be great. The next thing is to get Buddha Fruit. That's definitely the most important thing be before going to the second C. Buddha Fruit is the fruit where you can green almost the end with buddha fruit you'll grind a lot you always need to grind with buddha in the second c in the third c wherever you go and also you'll use this for solving puzzles killing bosses and do raids that's so important for it that you need to get this before you go into the second c because in the second c the best way to grind in the third c of course is to grind with buddha fruit and where to get this buddha fruit that's so easy so easy guys the first thing is to find the fruit yeah this completely free so as you can see i have fruit detector and i can see maybe i will i can find something interesting here so oh smoke <laughs> no smoke fruit i always get smoke or something cheap fruit by this notifier so why this fruit notifier is so expensive i don't know the next thing is to roll and of course the bad thing to get the buddha fruit and you need to go to jungle so everybody know this place so if you didn't know this place what happened to you so here you can find this npc right there depending on the level will be a different price so if you level 15 price will be i don't know 10 thousand something like that so i have the maximum level and you'll see the cost of my rolling is <laughs> almost 300 thousand belly 
yeah that's a lot i know but when you have this level that's not a big deal that's not a great money for you so you can get random fruit now i got spin fruit that's definitely the fruit i want every time i'm dreaming about this rolling fruits you can get not a buddha fruit of course but you can get so expensive fruit you can get some cheaper fruits and you can in the future exchange those so and if you're playing in the first c you have only two ways to get those fruits 